Affordable housing has always been a major issue. However, we've seen a few government initiatives that are trying to assist in this regard. Um, but there has been some uproar with regard to some of the hefty price tag being associated with some new NHT units. We have got here with us Petrina Stewart, youth advocate and youth parliamentarian, who spoke out about that situation <laughs> vociferously. Um, the other day, and she joins us this morning. Good morning to you, Patrina. Good hey, to Patrina. have you here. Good morning. Thank you so much for having me. It's good to have you. Can you tell me a little bit about your interest in politics before we delve deeper into this issue? I'm reading here that you discovered your voice at the tender age of six. Yes. Six yes. years old? Six years old. <laughs> I, I, I don't have an interest in politics, though. What I have an interest in is representation ah. and representing persons who are underserved persons who are underrepresented. That is what I have. So it's more interest. advocacy than it's politics. It's more advocacy than Copy politics. that. Copy that. Right. You see, a lot of people don't understand the difference, <laughs> you know. Um, and when you say youth parliamentarian, that's where people's minds right, go Right, right. Because they see us in parliament. Right. And that's where politicians right. are. And right. so people just associate it with, oh, she has an interest in politics now. You I have, have an interest. So you have no interest in politics? I have no interest in Zero. politics. Zero. Zero. Why? I have an interest in representation because I believe that, I mean... <laughs> shouldn't politics be about representation? It, it, it should be about representation, but we live in a society where we don't see where that is always true. Mm -hmm. And so I want to associate myself more with advocacy. If later down in life I decide that I want to go in politics, then that politics will be representational of advocacy mm -hmm. and of the people. You hear that, girl? It's a politician. A <laughs> Okay. Okay. So let's get to the meat of the matter. You chose the issue of housing for your submission to youth parliament. Why? Uh, St. Mary I, girl, I, why? I think the issue of housing chose me. Okay. Because I went into the city and I, I went there with a speech on financial literacy and, and oh. underemployment. And when we were there and our advisors were assessing the topics, they realized that housing wasn't getting enough attention. And at that point in time, it was, it was, it was the night before the sitting. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> I guess the...